And uh, I don't know if you guys know the American drama. Uh, it's uh, this by the housewife. There's an there is an old woman in it. Her name is Karen McCluskey, and uh, she removed all the audience at the end season of the drama because she uh, in the in the drama she uh, she she had a cancer. Um, and however, in real life, in the real life, she also had a uh, cancer too. Uh, but uh, but she she just uh, decided to continue take part in the drama and actor actor and also actor as a uh, cancer cancer patient. Uh, he just want told the audience um, enjoy life, don't be complain, and we still can do whatever we want to do. And, uh, so today's topic is uh, my topic is about technology. Yeah, I know someone has said uh, talk about it before. And uh, she is a famous comedian in America, and uh, she also deals with a cancer, a breast cancer. And uh, uh, and uh, she made uh, she made a really amazing performance in LA theater in front of 300 audience. Uh, she walked on the stage and began her prologue with "Hello, everyone, I have a cancer." Prologue means introduction to one's performance. And this is what he said. What he said on the. What she said, right? What she. <laughs> what she said on the performance. Um, At that moment, I mean, she walked on the stage. Uh, she walked on the stage, and she smiled to the audience, uh, and said, "Hello, everyone. I have a cancer." At that moment, she is very nervous and vulnerable because she don't know, or she didn't know what was in front of her. And the truth is, she has a can. She had a cancer. She didn't know where uh, where the cancer had spread of it, bad or there are. Uh, or, or how far? Uh, yeah. And uh, there are uh, besides cancer, uh, she also has two tragedy things happened. Um, one is she has a relationship with her girlfriend is is down, and her mother died caused by treatment. Mm. And as a comedy, she also like music. And she once she once uh, want, wanted to move to uh, to LA to open a to to develop her music job music career. Um, and after several days life lived in LA, he went in uh, he went into a comedy club, and uh, I think this is her first time decided to be a comedy. That's all. And uh, my response to this, mm. uh, first let me let, let me um, replace the uh, replace the uh, recording in LA theater.
should probably prefer, prefer the audience laugh. So the audience just laugh and they, they want to encourage her. Uh, this is and uh, this is American culture. Uh, the audience wants to encourage her. It's different from the other country. Uh, American people like to encourage people. Uh, we always hear, oh, good job, uh, good job, uh, you, you guys. And for, I still remember the first day I arrived in I arrived in San Francisco. I walked in a shopping mall, and uh, when I when I, when I went to the checkout, want to pay the money, and uh, the shop assistant wants to show my passport ID, and I because he just said show me your ID, I don't know what he mean, and uh, he said password ID. Then I took my passport, and she just she just said to me, a oh, good job. Uh, I was really surprised at it because it's really an and simple simple action. I just took my ID and showed him. He just said, "Oh, good job." And yeah, but um, but um, I think uh, after several 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 weeks like in San Francisco in America, and uh, I think uh, I all, I always get a good job from teacher provide uh, advisor. This is my own culture. Yeah, and another thing I think about, uh, and there's another interesting thing, TikTok in, uh, uh, no, Taro talked in her, uh, talked in Fresh Air. Uh, uh, she said, um, she said, um, after she knew she had the cancer, he first thought he should keep this secret because she don't want to lose job. Uh, she, uh, however, several days later, several days later, she made such an amazing performance prologue in LA theater. She told the public, "I have cancer. This is different to what he think before." Uh, uh, and I think it is also a matter of culture. People always do whatever she want to do, and uh, they enjoy the life. Uh, they enjoy the life uh, so much. Whatever they need, what challenger they should face, they just they just don't hesitate about it. Mm. And uh, it remind uh, remind me think a friend of mine, friend in America, he's a he's a he's a guy who play music in the high school, and now he is thirteen years old. And one day he think, oh, I'm really missing the day I play music in my high school. Then the next day he just went to shop by a keyboard and uh, and practice. So this is the two things I feel about the technical tarot.